What is happening guys? Cowboy here. Welcome back to Days Gone as always. Thanks to PlayStation for the copy. So, it's been a couple days since I played. Had all that travel coming up. Uh, I'll just, well, what else do I got? These are, are kind of boring missions. Um, there's that. Down. Okay, yeah, we're going to do we're going to do more of these, I guess. Um Yep, yeah, I had uh two different trips by this point. It's Friday's episode, yeah. So, it'll have been up by now. But anyway, yeah, so we did uh, Borderlands 3, which was super cool. Got to go to the reveal event, play for a couple hours, get some footage. Uh, and then the other trip was Code Vein, which a lot of people thought had basically died because they had been radio silent guarding that game for so long. So, it's, it's, it's nice to see it's alive and well. But anyway, we're back. Back to the grind. A little bit sick. Fucking trips. This is the one that, that's honestly the biggest thing I hate about trips every time, whether it's, you know, E3 or PAX. This is my first time getting sick going to a gaming event, but to be fair, they had like 600 fucking YouTubers and streamers at this thing, so it was, what the fuck was that? Bike almost just killed me. Um, I mean, it was basically like a, a mini PAX just for Borderlands. It was a fucking zoo, but came back with like a sinus infection. Big fucking surprise there. So anyway, I'm going to sound a little bit goofy for the next couple episodes. Let's ride on out, though. Do another one of these chopper missions. I really hope these culminate in something soon, because this is like the fourth or fifth, you know, stealth around the chopper. They're just, they're just not very engaging, you know? You can, like, take down the Nero guys and be one thing, but instead it's literally just like, alright, just creep on up and plant a beacon and then listen to somebody and then walk back to your bike. Like, my, my, all the stealth games I've played over the years have prepared me for something way harder than what we're doing here. O'Brien, I'm at one of your beacons, the one near Camp Creek. Uh, there's nothing here. Hold on. Uh, okay. A field op should be there any minute. You know the drill. O'Brien out. Yeah, I know the drill. Try not to get my ass shot off while being your goddamn peeping Tom. St. John out. Yeah, so what was that all about? I mean, last time we talked, it sounded like you were pissing your hazmat suit. It's nothing. I, I told you there are people above me who don't want us to know what's going on. I got too close. I almost got caught. You know what? I don't give a shit. All I want from you is information on Sarah. Whitaker, I've got someone working on it. It's, it's going to take time. I guess you have to be patient. Yeah? Do I? This research group isn't part of my unit, so I can't track them after this op. I need you to place a tracker on their chopper. Yeah, yeah, I get it. Oh, and you want me to spy on the guy? Down there you go. Bunch of tank soldiers marching as well. Jesus. Oh, we got him back fast. Try putting a gold wand 
watching our baboon for two years. Set it loose in the wild and see what happens to it. Okay, okay, I get your point. This watch looks new. Really? So? So, that means this subject has either been taking care of it, or has recently... Recently put it on? Shit, I thought they were all, you know... That shit crazy? Yeah, they are, but... Just as some late-stage dementia patients could still have moments of lucidity, victims of stage 2 virus infections seem to retain some level of vestigial memory. Oh, shit. <laughs> oh, shit. Look at its clothes. They're... Almost clean, right? I mean, not clean, but most freaks are so caked with shit and piss. Come on out. Make this easy for both of us. Yeah, well, again, put a pair of pants on a baboon for two years. Jesus. I don't know why I can't hear him well enough. Like I'm, I'm right here. I should be able to to hear that conversation a lot better. They get dressed, they put on their favorite gold watch, they kiss their wife goodbye, and then they head out the door for a fun day of eating us and shitting themselves. Why the hell are these guys wasting their time with this shit? Hope you got all that, O'Brien. Okay, now I just gotta get the hell out of here. O'Brien, are you there? O'Brien! Hold on. Yeah, I'm here. I planted your tracking device and I got your data. The researcher, were they male or female? What? What? Why? Was it a man or a woman? Uh, it was a woman and no, I didn't catch her name. See what we got going on next. Is that a fucking horde in front of me? Jesus Christ. No time for that to spawn. No, don't. Oh my god. <laughs> to say. Yeah, I think we're just gonna keep cruising. Let me see. Uh, there's the. I mean, her storyline's the one really interesting to me. This is just Tucker wanting me to do some bullshit. Opal wanting me to hunt somebody down. Killing bad guys. Three kilometers. Let's see if there's a fast travel. Oh no, insufficient fuel and I'm in combat. That's a day. Too late for marsh duty. Yeah, he's too bad. I'm schizo. Oh god, the oh, fuck? I was infected. Hey Ricky, you there? I'm uh I'm gonna be gone for a while. I'm gonna need you to cover for me. Skiz is gonna wonder why I'm not out on marsh duty or whatever the hell. Hey Deke. What's up? Boozer's uh hell. I don't know. He's he's depressed or something. Talk to Addy. I think I know a way to cheer him up. So what are you gonna do? Uh, I thought I'd maybe head to O'Leary Mountain, get his bike, That's all over back. That's a long way to go on foot. I'll figure something out. Are, are you gonna cover for me or what? Yeah. I don't even know where to 
start with this. Thanks, Ricky. Deacon out. Okay. No how to fix it. That sounds a lot more interesting than just uh, visiting a gravestone. And it looks like this might be the uh, last mission. This quest line. Just fast travel over there, and then uh, we'll drive his bike, and then fast travel back and get our bike. Hopefully it works like that. Bike. What the? <laughs> Men coming! Ah! Yeah! Run at him! Ah! Oh, shit. Shit! Shit! Oh my god, I forgot how bad the aiming is in this game. Finally. Ooh. Hey Ricky, did you send some men to go out and get him? Yeah, he's a lot more cooperative all of a sudden. Evidently our guys got to him just before a swarm. They offered to leave him where he was if he didn't tell him where the seats were. So <laughs> yeah, I, I really would have just left him there to rot. Yeah, you know what Iron Mike would say about that? Yeah, yeah, yeah. See you, Ricky. Got you. Hey. I can sell this. Track down Eric Lynch. Oh yeah, Mike. I found him. I want to thank you for not killing the man. We're gonna have a trial. He'll get a chance to tell his side of it. Great. Yeah, too bad Campbell and Reed aren't allowed to tell their side. Hey, we got folks that'll be there, speaking on their behalf. And we got witnesses. It's the way we do things, Deke. Why don't you give them to me for five minutes? You'll have a confession. Thanks. We got it covered. Iron Mike out. Booster, are you there? Hey, I brought you something. Wait, what the fuck? You you went up and got my bike? Well, I didn't want Cope getting it. Parting it out. Jesus, Dick. Hey, I mean, I mostly did it, you know, in case I need parts. It's not like your gimp ass is gonna need them. Shit. Thanks, brother. Yeah, that's the one thing I miss. Riding on the open road. Addie just wanted me to tell you that she paid some men to go get your bike and bring it back. It's over at the mechanic's shop. Oh, wait, what? You're welcome, Deke. Ricky out. Well, that was uneventful. Looked like a cool rap though. Looking to buy, I hope. She's looking for some stuff. Uh, 
Uh, check back later, I guess. Later. Where my keys like over here. Deke, a group of men rode in, shot up the gate, and when we wouldn't let them in, they rode off. Ah, shit. Which direction? Uh, they headed west, but they didn't go far. They set up camp just north of Eden Hill. I think they might be planning another attack, so I need you to take a look. <sighs> okay, right. Yeah, I'll handle it. Thanks, Deke. Jesus. Here for your bike? Hey, how's it going? with the rain already. It's kind of cool. The tires are slowly getting coated up with snow. I have to make some tea with honey after this episode. Like, when I woke up, I thought my sinuses had cleared out. And just being awake for, like, an hour and a half, and it's like, fuck. It's all like, it feels like it was worse than it was before. Oh, shit. Snow handling is no joke. St. John. Mark Copeland at Deacon St. John. Hey, Cope, what's up? Just checking in. A couple of my men were up to the top of Leary Mountain the other day. Said they found a safe house set up in an old Forest Service watchtower. Is that right? Yes, sir, that's what I'm told. They said it was abandoned, but funny thing. Whoever lived there left behind a bike. Good shape, too, by the sound of it. Really? Okay, Ricky, I'm near Eden Hill. Yeah, Drifter's still here. Can you handle it? Well, I guess we'll know soon enough. Deacon out. That not a headshot? Ah, shit, almost out. Shit, I'm running out of bullets here. Alright, um, well, let's do what we can. Now, what do we got? Yeah. Damn it! Freaks! Fire! Fire! How many you got left? Easy mode. I'll just take these. Oh, two points. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. Um. Uh. Yes, that'd be that'd be good. Oh, otherwise, regenerate stamina. Cocktail. Oh, uh, yeah, let's do the quick roll. Then drastically reduce stamina for rolling. Stun weaker enemies of the rock. Increase the, yeah, let's do home run. Home run, and then uh, executioner will be good. 
then retribution will be good. And then, I mean, that's not a bad one either. I could probably get that, but I want the, um... I mean, it's so easy St. to maintain John. the bat. This is Mark Copeland at Deacon St. John. Hey, Cope, what's up? Just checking in. A couple of my men were up to the top of O'Leary Mountain the other day. Said they found a safe house set up in an old Forest Service watchtower. Is that right? Yes, sir, that's what I'm told. Yeah. They said it was abandoned, but funny thing. Whoever lived there left behind a bike. Good shape, too, by the sound of it. Really? Indeed. That's not the funny thing. The funny thing is they went back up there today to pick it up, but the bike was gone. Now, ain't that a hit scratcher? Look, Cope, this is all really fascinating, but, uh... Now, hold on. Here's the fascinating part. They swear that old bike, well, it looked a lot like the one Boozer used to ride. Okay, so let me get this straight, Cope. You guys went up to O'Leary Mountain. You found what you thought was Boozer's bike. And the first thing you thought of was, hey, why don't we just go back and steal it? Salvage, Deke. Salvage. But no, that was my second thought. My first was, whatever happened to old Boozer? Manny says he hasn't seen him around for some time. I don't know, Cope. Next time I see him, I'll let him know how much you miss him. St. John out! Not sure what the point of that exchange was. But damn, I need to get some tea. I feel like I've gone from like okay, okay. to bad to worse. Just trying to like breathe and, and speak in this episode. How'd it go? It's done. They won't be shooting up any more camps. Oof, thank God. I'll let Iron Mike know. You know, keep this up and you and Mike are gonna be best friends before you know it. Bye. Yeah, Addy, what's up? Can you stop by the infirmary when you get a chance? Anything wrong? No, I just need to talk to you. Ah, uh, yeah, okay. Man, I made it back on fucking fumes. I don't even think I can get up this hill. Nope, I can't. <laughs> Oh my god, come on, turn the bike, turn the bike. Might be able to just leave it here and fill it up. I don't know if this is considered... I mean, yeah, there's stuff here. This is in the encampment, I'm pretty sure. Just gonna hope we can fill it up over there. Um, anyway, so looking at our missions here. Oh, god damn it. I thought we were done with Boozer. Well, I guess we got some more Boozer stuff coming up, so we'll uh we'll get started with that in the next episode. I'm gonna go make something to clear out my sinuses so I can actually talk. And other than that, I'll catch you guys soon enough, so stay tuned.